this is Brie with Brie Body Goods. Today we're going to make a baby powder soap, a simple soap, not too much, not too complex for us, no um, extra design. Um, I know I haven't made any videos for a while. I had a little setback due to an injury, but I'll get into that in another video. But hey, I'm back and slowly but surely I'm going to, you know, go ahead and get more videos out. But right now we're gonna go ahead and jump into the video. Right now I'm adding a, my kaolin clay to the oils. I'm gonna go ahead and mix that good into my oils. Make sure it's very incorporated before I add my lye solution. I add a little too much, but that's okay. It won't hurt anybody. I like using kaolin clay. It makes the soap glide on your skin. And also it has its benefits of detoxifying your skin as well. And I really like using clays. You'll see more of those in my videos as well later on this year. So why, uh, while I um, finish mixing that together, I'm getting my life solution. I'm going to go ahead and strain it because I did add, add silk to it as well. So this is going to be a luxury soap due to the oils that I use, cocoa butter and shea butter. And now I'm adding my lye. You know, you let it pour down your stick blender because it, you know, it, it helps with the bubbles, you know. So I just poured that. I'm going to go ahead and mix that very well into my oils. Make sure everything is um, incorporated before we go ahead and get started making our soap. You cannot make soap without lye. You hear anyone say that? They're a complete lie. <laughs> lie, lie. Uh, Bree, get it together. This is my first voiceover, so please bear with me. I'm still new to this, so do not beat me up, please. But right now, I'm going to keep mixing it, mixing it, mixing it. So right now I'm going to go ahead and add my um, titanium dioxide because I would like a white soap. The whole, the base is going to be completely white because I do have some bits that I did um, put on the side for this soap. It just wasn't white enough for my liking so I just went ahead and add the rest. So I'm going to keep blending, blending until it's very incorporated into the soap. And I am working on my angles. I just have to keep working on it until I find the right spot. And I know I'm not wearing any gloves um, any, and that long sleeves. Please don't be like me. I just don't have any and I was so eager to get back to making soap. It's been so long. And I was just excited to just make something. So right now I just, just went ahead and threw in my fragrance oil, the baby powder fragrance oil mixed with vanilla stabilizer because you know it, it does have a little vanilla in it and I'm just hoping that it does not brown my soap because of the vanilla. So I'm going to mix, 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 mix to make sure it's very incorporated into my soap and it smells so good. That's why I was taking so long. I was just enjoying that smell. Who doesn't like baby powder? fragrance like I catch myself using my kids baby powder because I just like the smell of it all right so I'm going to go ahead and keep mixing 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 because I want it just a little thick not too runny so I find like a good thick trace not too thick just a little bit all right all right now I'm just going to do a little cleanup and get ready to pour Using my little two um, pound slab mold, my two pound mold, it's not really a slab, but my two pound um, mold. All right, go ahead and I spritz my container with alcohol. Can't go wrong with that anytime. Still disinfecting, no problem with doing that. Even though I did it before, I just spray, spray, spray. 
All right, let's pour. Everybody loves that part. I love to pour. I just like to watch it pour. It looks so creamy and good, you know. I had a little bit more left over. I poured it in another mold that I have um, put to the side. It's made some little personal soaps for me. So right now I'm throwing in my little embeds that I um, previously made earlier today um, in a little container that you see there, that blue container. I just popped them back out and just cut them up in little pieces. And these are not scented in the baby powder um, fragrance. I just left it as it be, um, as is, I'm sorry. I just did a little um, blue mica to give me that light blue color. I feel like I should have did something more, but I just, that's what came to my mind at the time. So right now I'm just gonna go ahead and add that there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and speed it up. We're done with that. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little cleanup on the side of the soap, well, on my mold, because I just hate, I just get a little OCD when that stuff is all around my mold like that. But I can't help it, nobody can help it. It happens, that's part of making soap. If it's not messy, you're not doing enough something right. You know, so right now I'm just gonna make sure every little piece that I see that's out of place or I feel that it's not embedded into the soap good, I'm going to go ahead and continue to push them in a little bit more, make sure none have any fallout when I do have to do the cut um, for my soap. And I do have a um, big cartel shop that I do uh, have listed in my description box. Right now, my sh I have my shop temporarily closed for a reason because I was out of commission and I wasn't able to do any shipping or anything because I do everything myself for now. So please just bear with me, but sooner or later, it's, everything is going to be back up because right now I'm doing my restocking and I do still have soaps ready, but I'm just restocking and, you know, rebranding as well. Just I've been, while I was on break, I have been thinking about a lot and what I want to do differently. So yeah, so that's the end of that. We'll get to that any other time you guys ask. So we're done with the soap. Um, now I'm just spritzing with the alcohol. Love my alcohol. Um, it cuts down on the soda ash. So here it is. All right, you guys. We are finished with the baby powder soap. Please be on the lookout for another video with the cut. I do appreciate you guys for stopping by and watching my video. Please like, share, and comment, and make sure that you do subscribe for more videos. Bye.